<clears throat> Don Cheadle tattletailed on a beetle. Dr. Spock dropped a crockpot with his socks on. I forgot my grenade in a school bus. <laughs> Welcome to What's Your Predicament. I'm your host, Bill Gilliard. And I'm Dale McGillicuddy. And this is the early morning advice radio show for the Greater Lakes area. That's right. Bill and I have over a combined 65, 65. years of armed forces service. We're here to field your calls and provide our most sage advice for your trickiest of predicaments. That's right. It seems we're already getting a number of calls, so while our producers line that up, uh, first I want to ask, how was your weekend? Well, to be honest, Bill, it was pretty tiring. Trista kept waking me up every night, licking my face and begging me for a bowl of food. And Trixie, of course, is your cat? My wife. Your wife. My, your, uh, yeah, my wife. Right, right. It seems like our first caller is uh, good to go. So remember, if you want to call the station with your own questions, uh, just call our number. That's 912. Caller, you are live. What's your predicament? My, my, my car's all busted up, and, and I need some help. Oh, boy. I don't advice. All right. Well, uh, well, what's your name, and where are you calling from? My name's David Robinson, and and I'm on the corner of Willow and Main. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold your horses there, Buckaroo. We don't want your home address on the air now, do we? I, I don't think you understand. I, I was just in a car crash, and I, my phone's about to die. I, I think I need an ambulance. All right. You know what? I'm sick and tired of these pranksters. Uh, Boy, Ron, I tell you? can we get the next caller, please? We, we ready? What's your predicament? Hiya. Long-time listener, many-time caller. Hiya, Marcy. Let me guess, you're stuck elbow deep in a gumball machine again, aren't you? Yeah. All right, Marcy, you listening? Yeah. Can you sing, Marcy? No. Marcy, can you dance? Kinda. Marcy, are you near a subway? Yeah. You're wearing a big old hat, Marcy. Yeah. All right, Marcy, here's what you gotta do. Okay. Marcy, throw your hat in the ground. All right. Marcy, declare to the crowd, hear ye, hear ye, gather around. Did it? Put your right foot in. Yeah. Take your right foot out. Yeah. Put your right foot in. Yeah. Now shake it all about. Yeah. They throwing money in your hat there, Marcy. Yeah. Marcy, what's a gumball in that machine there cost? About 25 cents. Put a quarter in. Yeah. Pull your right arm out. Yeah. Are you free, Marcy? Yeah. And, and that's, that's what, what it's all like. about. Thank you, Marcy. That'll be all. All right, now remember, if you want to call in with your own questions, again, that number is 912. Uh, it seems we have the next caller ready. All right, let's fire away. What's your predicament? There is a huge flame in my kitchen. Oh, a culinary question. Well, I cook a mean pork chop if I do say so myself. I don't think you understand. It's a real rager. Uh, a rager? Like a party? Like a dinner party? No, my house, it's on fire. My wife, my kids, my husband. Pranks? Really, Ron? Really, Ron? Seriously. If you keep letting the pranksters get through the... The people with the real predicaments, they're not going to get the help they need. That's right. And to the folks out there who are actually interested in our advice, that number again is 912. Oh, okay. We have another call. This one better be real, Ron. Swear to my suspenders. What's your predicament? Hello? I just got home from work and everything's gone. They took my furniture, my, my, my television, even my dog. Ron! Ron! Are you serious, Ron? Honestly. Ron. How do you do it? Ronald. It's almost amazing. Oh my. I just... Pranks! Hello? I forgot to take my insulin shot this morning and I, I, I need a candy bar or something. I'm stranded. Please, somebody... Start... No. Ron! 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 You're supposed I to be our net. Are you serious? P people are dying. You're letting us down. They're dying to hear our advice. Hello? Uh, my dad. He fell off the roof. He hurt real bad. Please send help. Ron! The gates of Tartarus swing both ways, Ron! <laughs> I've got a good sense of humor. You're the one who's... I know the press! It's not us. It's you. I'm sick of it! He... Look at him. Look at me. No, look at me, Ron. No, no. Look at me! Are you looking? Which one are you looking at, Ron? I took my glasses off. I can't tell. My theory knows no bounds! We're Ronathan! I'm done. I'm... Are you done? Get it! Get out of the trash, Ron! Well, I guess we're the ones with the predicament now. Huh, Dill? So it would seem, Bill. So it would seem. I... I don't know. I just don't feel so well. Uh, 
I think I need to call my cardiologist. I'm gonna have a palpitation or something. Oh yeah, you should do that, but uh, make it quick. Oh, I called the wrong number. Whoops. Well, how'd you manage to do that? Well, I'm stressed. It's a tense situation. I might hit a miss a button. Jeez, relax. D take one of these. It's called a chill pill. Dill. Well, maybe I will take a chill pill, Bill. <sighs> this is not good for us. I, uh, okay. Let's just do one more. Let's wrap it up. Ron? Okay. Again, that number is, uh, 912. Okay, yep. All right. What's your predicament? Hello. There's a man in my house. I'm hiding in the closet. Uh, I can hear him getting closer. All, all right, Please, lady. Uh, hurry. Where do you get off pranking our advice show, huh? What? Is this 911? No. This is 912. No, 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 no. My stars and garters. Oh, cheese and crackers. Garters. Lady? Lady? God, jeez, Gil, we gotta call the proper authorities on this one. <sighs> what? What? Really, Ron? Right now. Another another call. Okay. Uh, hello, what's hello. your- Hello, I'm the host of a radio advice show, and I need some serious help. Finally. A real predicament. Ron, are you serious? I mean, wow. Just wow. Ron. <laughs> <laughs> Warm up line three, take four. Action. Hold on, let me get my voice real quick. There we go. The Black Panther was an overrated movie. I was hoping you'd do that. Oh. <laughs> Ron, the gates oh. of Tartarus swing both ways, <laughs> Ron. My fury knows no bound. <laughs> Can we do that again? That's so funny.